Hey guys, so today I'm gonna be trying the trending. First of all, no, yeah, that's what I'm. That's what I'm doing. Let me just let me just do it how I said how how I how I think I'm gonna. Do. Hi guys, today I'm gonna be trying the trending. I spit. Hold on. Hey guys, today I'm gonna be trying the trending foundation from CoverGirl in LA, Simply Ageless. Um, this hat is supposed to be a dupe. It never focuses. I hate this. This is supposed to be a dupe for the KVD Good Apple Foundation, which is sold out everywhere. Uh, I've gone to like four Sephora's to try and find it, and I can't find it. And honestly, this was a struggle to find as well, because why did I have to go to five Targets and an Ulta to, to get this? And then I honestly don't even know if this is my shade. I've never used a CoverGirl foundation, so we're all in for a treat today. Um, yeah. And there's another dupe out actually. It's the Milan, it's a Milani powder to foundation. Um, let me find it. Let me find the actual name. Okay, so it's the Milani Conceal and Perfect Smooth Finish Cream to Powder Foundation. And I got that. Um, but they don't sell a lot of different Milani products in stores, so I actually had to get that online. And so I'll be testing that out. Um when it gets here so like i said yeah i really hate trends because it's because everyone is everyone and they want to try to buy stuff and so it's like by the time i get my hands on it like i finally i finally get it the trend is over and then i'm late and i hate being late to the party but whatever so um i have already primed my face i did my brows and i put on some lashes i don't have anything else on my skin i do normally um what is it i um conceal my hyperpigmentation but today i'm not going to do that because i want to give you guys an honest review this is supposed to be very full coverage so i hope it is um it has titanium dioxide sunscreen and hyaluronic complex and vitamin c um with a broad spectrum of sp28 okay so i got this in the color 245 warm beige i just took a guess because i am beige in milani products so i'm just like let's see if it works um so this is how it looks if it all focus okay this is how it looks how it comes um if you guys saw that little streak i did that i was also concerned about that because heckles were in target like swatching these foundations i'm like first of all we're in a pandemic you touch everything and now you swatching foundation that people are gonna put on their face whatever okay so i'm gonna do it let's get a little swirly swirl here i'm concerned I know it's supposed to it's supposed to match my neck and I have hyperpigmentation on my neck as well so let's see so I'm gonna zoom you guys in give you some up close and personal can you see me I hope you can see me I, yeah you can see me I want it to focus on my right whatever let's see looks a little light yep so that's not my color so will i be able to <laughs> will i even be i won't even be able to do this because it's too light it was cute though it covered um i have a pigmentation so hmm. well i guess that's that for this video that you guys are probably like well why didn't you get a really why am i even doing this whatever i'm like there you guys are probably like well why didn't you get um multiple shades they were sold out okay so i guess i'm just i'm just i'm just gonna go wipe this off because i saw what i needed to see i'm not even gonna give you guys a um Um, I'm not even gonna give you guys. What am I not gonna give? I'm not gonna give anything because I have nothing to give. Because right now I have a white cast on my face. I look like a ghost. This was the only shade they had. So I guess I'm just gonna have to come back and um, give you guys an actual 
review when I find my right shade. I don't know why I want to try this anyway. I want to, but I just can't. This is like two shades too light. This is like a highlight. Hmm. And I, it takes me forever to put out content and then I, I decide to put out content and it's, it's just all wrong. All right, well, let me go wipe this off and I'm sorry to disappoint. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go find another shade. Okay, another day, another attempt. Um, I, re what did I do? I exchanged the Cover Our Olay Simply Ageless foundation. Um, I initially had 245 some type warm beige or something like that, but now I have 255 soft honey. I went up two shades because the other one was way too light. It was very ghostly. Um, so I'm gonna try this. Hopefully it works. I'm a little nervous. No, we'll see. Okay, 255. Also, I noticed when I went to return it that it only went up to 255. So if this isn't my shade, I don't know what CoverGirl and Olay are doing that they're not that they don't have darker shades. Why does it, this looks exactly the same as um the first one whatever let's see let's see let's see if this don't work i'm just it's just gonna have to be what it is why are these so light Does the light match to you? Not to me. No. N well, I don't know. No, this is way too ashy. Just way, way too ashy. Am I, do, am I doing something wrong that two of these won't work? Because this is odd. This is odd. I didn't even get I didn't even get to do a full makeup look because because this is fraudulent. That's what I'm gonna say. I don't know who this works for, but it don't work for me okay um and i'm not even i'm i just feel like i'm not even gonna do i'm not even gonna try this again i'm not even gonna try to look for a darker shade or anything um this dupe may work for some of you of lighter complexion but not for someone like me so this is It's done. I'm through. Um, is this supposed to sit? You know, it doesn't even matter. It like I feel. I'm thinking it's the. <coughs> Excuse me. No COVID. Um, I'm thinking it's supposed to. Yeah, it might have to sit for a little bit and um, you know oxidize. But like it looks fine on my neck. But I'm. I, it's, I'm not. It's not. I'm not getting into it. I don't like it. I really don't. So that's the end of this. Um, I will come back when my Milani KDD dupe gets here in the mail. Um, but as of right now, the CoverGirl Plus Olay Simply Ageless. It's it's two thumbs down. Two thumbs down. Two thumbs down for me. I'm not doing it. So. Um, sorry <laughs> but um yeah i'm gonna do another video so you see you see me wearing this um it's the same thing i've been on here for four minutes 15 seconds <sighs> all right guys i'll see you i'll see you next in the next video okay